Worcestershire celebrate the title Worcestershire put the icing on the cake to a memorable season as they followed up ceiling promotion 24 hours earlier by clinching the Spexivers County Championship Division II title. Skipper Joe Leach's side clocked up their ninth win in 14 games as they overpowered Durham by 137 runs at New Road in the first championship win over their opponents for 14 years. Durham were set a target of 370 in 76 overs and were bowled out for 232. Indian star Ravichandran Ashwin capped his spell at New Road by finishing with 595. Victory rendered events irrelevant at Hoveware, Nottinghamshire, the only side who could overhaul Worcestershire going into the finale of the season, fought out a tame draw with Sussex. It was fitting that the final day of the season featured strong contributions from two of Worcestershire's outstanding performers this summer and former captain Daryl Mitchell and his successor Leach. Mitchell scored his seventh championship century of the season, a tally only bettered by Suri's Kumar Sangokara, and ended the campaign with 1,266 runs at an average of 55.04. Then Leach, who replaced Mitchell at the helm this summer, took his championship wicket tally to 69, the highest in Division II, with an early double strike to set his side on their way to victory. But it has been the ultimate team effort which has seen director of cricket Steve Rhoda side across the finishing line in the four-day format. Joe Clark, Brett De Oliveira, Ben Cox and Ed Bernard have also made sizable contributions with the bat, while paceman Josh Tung and Bernard have both weighed in with 40-plus wickets apiece in support of Leach. The contribution of Ashwin on and off the field should also not be underestimated in helping to restore belief for the final four games after a mid-season blip in the T20 blast. Mitchell helped to set up the declaration after Worcestershire resumed on 1573. He reached three figures off 134 balls with nine fours and ended undefeated on 123 out of 24-23. Mitchell was given excellent support by George Rhodes 51, not out in an unbroken stand of 111 in 24 overs. Leach got to work with the ball and trapped Cameron Steele 5 and Jack Burnham 11 both LBW before lunch. Then Ashwin had Keaton Jennings 20 in his final innings for Durham, pouched by Mitchell at slip. Graham Clark and Paul Collingwood provided staunch resistance in a stand of 88 in 20 overs. But then wickets started to fall in quick succession. Bernard removed Collingwood 36 and Clark 62 both LBW in successive overs, and Ashwin returned to dispose of Ryan Pringle who was caught off a top edge at square leg. By T. Durham had moved on to 1486 with 33 overs remaining. The end came quickly after the interval. Leach bowled Michael Richardson 17 and Ashwin removed Liam Traviscus 9 and Chris Rushworth 0 with successive deliveries. Then Ashwin completed his nap hand when Graham Onions was caught at cover to spark wild scenes of celebration.